Hi, this is Shadi. Today we're gonna see just how effective not only martial arts are, but their basics. So today's story is about a 16 year old wrestler who actually stopped a kidnapping. Of course, the um, video of the news outlet uh, in its entirety will be in the description uh, below, but uh, it struck me because it's very important and just how dire some situations can be and just the basics that we all know and practice can just alleviate and save people's lives. A woman's children were about to be kidnapped and here he was, a 16 year old, just came in and saved the day. So the woman according to the news she hid in the bathroom and she called the police or 911 and she called for help however the kidnapper locked everyone out and so uh, from far away the 16 year old uh, Kanan Bauer heard the commotion got out of his truck immediately rushes in as you can see he's a big guy and he tells that it wasn't anything particular he just held him and put him down so there was no throw i would guess a body lock takedown more or less so he put him down as you can see he is in side control or yoko shiho gatame he stops people from interfering because as he said they were in my way they were piling up and it can be very dangerous minutes later cops got in and actually arrested him so it could have gone so much worse so this is a very basic pin that he used called yoko shiho gatame in judo or side control and as you can see from this kodokan demonstration it's an incredibly versatile pin what does that mean it means that however they move or whatever reaction they get you can actually change your hands or your position in a way and you can still keep it that's what's important uh, about this pin so uh, it's a very basic pin as all of you know a white belt knows it a white belt uh, somewhat knows how to maintain it and we all know the leverage and the the torture that this pin can provide yet it does not hurt so this is very important you see a lot of jujitsu street fights and some guy gets in a rear naked choke and it can go wrong in so many ways the the man on the subway uh, a while back unfortunately lost his life um, you can let them go and their head can bounce off the concrete it can go wrong in so many ways but pins will always be your best friend especially in isolated situations like this one where the store was closed all you're surrounded with are people who you know are not gonna interfere in a bad way or he has friends so he kind of cornered himself with the wrestler in that store while he attempted the kidnapping so uh, this is one case where groundwork can be very good uh, a lot of the times can obviously go bad uh, their friends can interfere but here you can see that this kidnapper was all alone and you have to mind your surrounding in these uh, situations so here you see it's just so versatile you can grab the legs you can grab the chest you can grab the head and arm uh, it's just so many ways you can do this very basic pin and you can actually just keep someone under control for minutes as i mentioned before cops uh, for minutes uh, it took them until they got to the scene and actually arrested the man so um, this is just how important pins uh, are and maintaining position so learning judo or grappling or any martial art that can benefit society is very important i'm gonna go on a little tangent but please hear me out it's very important jigoro kano says that judo should be about three edu types of education physical as we just saw moral as again we just saw like he heard the commotion he came in he has the spirit of a judoka in my opinion and of course intellectual we should always strive to learn and be wiser as we age so 
all the basics will take you very far in life, not just in martial arts, as you just saw. So I often talk about them in regards of competition, but also, as you can see here, in very dire situations. Also, uh, little things in life, when you learn as a child, the basics will take you a very long way. Let me give you an example. The first thing your parents teach you when you are interacting with strangers are maybe those two are the most important when you're talking to someone always look at them it means you are showing them respect and also always say thank you meaning show gratitude and they're teaching you gratitude so think about it when you lose so many relationships in life as you get older maybe professional intimate uh, friends etc most of the time they're due to those two reasons a lack of respect and lack of appreciation and or gratitude so these basics will take you very long in this life for example if you are driving and then you get at a crossroad and then you tell that person to pass you or you you maybe uh, you know do a hand gesture so they can understand that they can pass so some people their face absolutely lights up they smile at you you can see their face or when you hold the door for them uh, you can see or some people honk some people blink their lights they just show uh, gratitude and that's very important and these are people that you're probably not gonna see again in your life and so what you did for them it's not because you need something in return but it's simply because courtesy and respect are very important it's what makes the world better and sometimes the opposite happens they just walk by or through the door or they keep driving without even looking uh, at you and without even showing a glimpse it's like you don't even exist and it's almost like you work for them and it always leaves a very bitter taste uh, in your mouth because they repaid your courtesy and respect with disregard and disrespect and again you didn't have to do this so uh, these basic things clearly are very important in this life so this is why judo is moral intellectual and physical education all these things go hand in hand and this man or teenager just got out of his truck he was far away walked in and solved the situation while the cops took them minutes unfortunately to go in who would, who knows what would have happened to that woman and her children so I'll leave the link in the description below if you have anything to add please let me know down below this was shady and as always thank you for listening